The scuffle between police and supporters of FDC flag bearer Dr. Kizabes J broke out when he was blocked from proceeding to Taliet IDP camp in Boko district on Wednesday. Police fired tear gas and live bullets to disperse the crowd, and two people were injured in the placards that ensued. <laughs> The Electoral Commission says the incident could have been avoided if the right procedures were followed. The reference point should be Electoral Commission. Whether it is police, whether it is a candidate, before anything else happens. So our appeal goes to every stakeholder in this election. Please consult the Electoral Commission in case you don't know anything. The commission's spokesperson, Jotham Talemoa, told NTV that they have asked police to explain what transpired. Bestia says this is a clear manifestation that police is being used by the ruling party. It's a deliberate political decision. A, the Uganda police is acting as an agent of NRA. A statement issued by police says Bestia was wrong to divert his planned campaign schedule. However, Bestia maintains that police had no right to deny him access to his supporters living in the camps. So what they are doing is simply trying to stifle our freedom to influence the political opinion of people. NTV has learned that one of Bestia's bodyguards has been disarmed after the confusion under unclear circumstances. What is happening is what has been happening all along. It's criminality of the police. This incident comes after the commission stated that any nominated candidate has the right to access an area where he is or electorate.